All right, folks, we have our zoo guest. It's Friday. Already knocking things, <laughs> knocking things over. Sorry. Here goes it's, your water bottle. It's okay. <laughs> so we have Charlie here from the Gladys Porter Zoo, and he is joining us today with a large boa. Yes, this is a red-tailed boa, and uh, this is actually his first time on exhibit. He's a really good snake. He's been at the zoo for quite some time, and they let me uh, borrow him for just for the new segment. And... Um, they're actually one of my favorite uh, snakes because uh, they're so beautiful. They're they're mm -hmm. uh, uh, so interesting to to handle just because uh, of their size, and people love them because they are beautiful uh, coloration in the snake. And they're a little bit uh, easier to handle than some of the other pythons, like the okay. Burmese python that we have. Uh, she's a little bit too big sometimes, but um, for the most part, they can be found in. Central and South America, so the different parts of Latin America, oh and um, they can get pretty big, you know, as you can see right here. I know. How is this about as big as it's going to get, or they, is it? They there's a a huge range. They can go from anywhere from like three to maybe 13, 14 feet. That's mm -hmm. like an extreme. Um, for the most part, uh, females are a little bit larger. Okay. And um, one of the interesting things between um, everybody always asks, what's the difference between a, a boa and a python? So, yeah. um, uh, pythons lay eggs. Oh, okay. And boas will give birth live, not like a mammal live birth, mm -hmm. uh, but uh, the the eggs are in internal and they hatch and then they they release. A little bit, a little interesting fact. Wow. And boas <laughs> are from the Americas okay. and pythons are either from Asia or Africa. <laughs> I just love it because you can see <laughs> the, the the end tail over here just like swerving all over. Yeah, the it's desk. kind of. Basically, all he's doing is just trying to find something to grab onto so he can be a little bit more secure. Wow. And so this is pretty interesting now. Is there other ones? Is this like one of a kind that you have all at the zoo? Actually, this is the only boa constrictor we have at the zoo, but we only, the red-tailed boa, mm -hmm. but we actually have um, other uh, boas and pythons. His exhibit is not completely done because we did a real renovation, but um, maybe in a couple months his exhibit will be ready. You can go visit him. Perfect. And I know you have a discount day coming up. Yes, so we have um, in February uh, mm -hmm. 7th, we're going to have a Winter Texan discount day. So if you want to, um, Winter Texans want to take advantage of that, you know, mark your calendar for um, the 7th. It'll be $5 for the entrance. Awesome. And you can go and see this, your friend here. Do you have a name for this? You ball? know what? Um, I don't know his name, so we can name him. Oh, what do perfect. You wanna... <laughs> Joey. <I don't> Joey. <laughs> <laughs> Joey there we seems go. like a good name. All right, folks. Well, we will be right back. Thank you again, Charlie, for coming Thank in you. today. We will be right back in about two minutes.